What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 30 minute leg workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. to your 30 minute legs workout. I'm so excited to get started with you. Hope you're here ready to work. Okay, before we get started, I've got 10, 15, and 20 pound dumbbells. Okay, so make sure you have some dumbbells that are suitable for your fitness level. Another option to increase the difficulty of this workout is to have a mini band, a resistance band that you can put over your thighs. Okay, I'm not gonna do that, do that today, but if you wanna step it up a little bit, obviously I'm always down for that, okay? Make sure you have a water bottle and a sweat towel because we'll be working hard. And if you're ready, we'll get started with our warm up. Okay, so hands on your hips. We're gonna go single leg butt kicks in three, two, one, let's go. Good job. So we're warming up the quads here. You get the hamstrings pulling those heels to your glutes. Good job. Four. One, drive the knee to the chest. Okay, stay nice and wide. Here you go. Kind of like a high, wide march. There we go, and bring it into the middle. Heel taps. Okay, so you're doing an external rotation of your knee. Okay, open the knee to the side. Heel to the center. Good, open up those hips a little bit. Good, four. Three, two, one, nice and wide. Staying with the hips. We're gonna go side to side. Okay, stretching adductors, stretching hips, getting the glutes activated. There we go. Three, two, one. Now come back into the center and I want you to push your hips back and hinge forward. Back and forth. There you go, reach and squeeze. Good, three, two, one, and come back into the center. Let's go jumping jacks. Okay, we'll get the feet moving, get the heart pumping. Three, two, one, and rest. Give me three torso turns each side. Two, two, one, one. All right, I want you to grab your light set of dumbbells. Your first 45 seconds, we're in a nice wide stance. Dumbbells are at your legs. We're gonna go lunge gliders, left to right. Ready, let's go. Left, middle, right, middle. Okay, keeping those arms nice and relaxed. Shoot your hips back and come back forward. Okay, from the side, you'll notice I'm not just bending my knee, but I'm shooting my butt backwards. Back and back. Okay, push into the floor, nice job. You've got 15 seconds. And we'll rest, and then we'll go one more time. Okay, we're gonna stay moving today. Push, push, four, three, two, one. 15 seconds rest. Same move one more time. The option to advance your dumbbell weight is always there. So if you can go up, let's go up. Five seconds, grab those dumbbells. Here we go, two, one, let's go. Sit back and then down. You're going back and down. I always like to use the hips as the point of reference. Okay, so think of your hips. They move back first. And then you sit. Great job. 20 seconds left. And then we're gonna switch to your heavier dumbbells for a Romanian deadlift. Good, keep pushing. Seven seconds. Sit lower and lower. Two. One, rest. Your next move, sumo, so wide stance, Romanian deadlift, okay? I'm gonna bump my weights up. We're going in seven, six. Here we go, two, one, let's go. Shoulder blades back, slight bend in the knee. Reach 
and squeeze. Big stretch in the hamstrings. Shoot the butt back. Keep a nice flat back as well. Don't let yourself just fold over, okay? There's a difference in a fold and a hinge, okay? You're not just bending down to touch your toes. You're shooting your hips back. And as that happens, the forward fold of your body occurs. And rest, good. Okay, one more time through that one. So what do I mean by that? Make sure you're not just going down to bend over. Your main objective, shoot the hips backwards. As that happens, your chest folds forward, okay? Round two, let's go. Squeeze it in. Don't arch your back, don't round your back. It's completely flat. Hips go back, hips come all the way forward to meet your dumbbell. You've got 10 seconds left. Dumbbells, plural I should say if you're using two. This is another great move also if you wanna use a kettlebell. Two, one, and rest. 15 seconds rest. Give me one of your light or medium dumbbells. Okay, we're gonna go split squat, dumbbell overhead. Step that left leg back with me. Okay, and we're gonna tap down and up. Ready? Let's go. Down and up. So on your way up, I want you to put equal pressure into the floor from both feet. Okay, both legs are at 90 degrees at the bottom. Whew. Work on stabilizing here with me. There we go. If you need to modify, bring the dumbbell to your chest or drop the dumbbell all together. Good, down, up, down, up. There we go, nice tight abs. Dumbbell stays right over your head. If it's overhead, and rest, or right over your chest if it's here, okay? Don't let it sling forward. One more time on that same leg, okay? Make sure your feet are hip width apart. Two, one, let's go. If your feet are directly behind each other, like you're walking on a tightrope, this exercise is gonna be a lot harder. Both feet are pushing into the floor on the way up, so you're not ending up back here, and you're not ending up up here, right in the middle of the two of them. Ten more seconds as of right now. Keep going, big push guys, come on. Down as low as you can go. Can you tap the floor? Two, one, rest. Okay, 15 seconds rest. Same exact exercise, we're just going to the other leg, okay? So, left leg out front, right leg behind, or whatever opposite is to you. Ready? Let's go. Both feet are pushing down. the abs tall, your spine is nice and straight, and if you're like me, you found a spot right on the wall in front of you to stare at. Okay, 15 more seconds. Keep breathing, keep focusing. Three, two, one, rest. Good. I try not to talk too much on these single leg things so you can really focus on your balance, okay? So find a spot on the wall, stay right there. You're just going up and down like your body is in a cylinder. You have to go up and down, right inside of it. Round two, let's go. 
Okay, so think of that cylinder. You're inside. That means you can't shoot forward, can't shoot backwards. Going straight down just like you're in a squat. You sit straight down and come straight back up. Come on, work hard. I know one side is a little more balanced and that's okay. Just work harder on that side. You've got three, two, one, rest. Come on down on your knees onto all fours. No dumbbells required for this one. Okay, you're gonna go into a bear crawl position. That means hands are down, toes are down, and knees are up. Right leg only, you're gonna reach and tuck. Ready, two, one, let's go. Reach it out, tuck it in. If you need to modify, when you tuck it in, you can drop your knees back down, lift, reach, tuck, drop. Okay, this is a burner for the leg that is stationary. Okay, I know. There we go, 15 more seconds. Good, five, four, three, two, one, rest. We're gonna switch legs on this one. Round number two, keep the opposite leg here. Kick that left leg back, or whatever leg you didn't just do. Let's switch it for round two, okay? Big deep breath. I know this one hurts. We're almost there, two, one, let's go. Lift the knees, reach, and back. And what I want you to notice is that my butt is not up here. It's down, so my knees are bent. Straighten, come back to bent. If you're modifying, drop, lift, straighten. Drop, lift, straighten. Here we go, 15 seconds. Woo! Keep pushing with me. Keep your back flat. Think about setting a book on top of your back. Five, four, rest, Woo. all right, switching back to the first side. This one is brutal, Woo. maybe it's just me. If you guys are with me, good job. Okay, here we go, first leg, round number two. Ready, let's lift and go. So keep it here, keep that knee off the ground as long as you can. And then drop it when you need to modify. Lift and kick. We all have to modify sometimes. It is okay. Lift, reach, and come back in. Woo, 20 seconds. Yes, I know, I know, come on. Give me 10 more seconds, okay? 10, nine, Three, two, one, rest. Woo. Oh yeah, sweat is pouring, legs are burning. We got one more round on that other side. And then we're gonna be standing, or we're gonna be switching exercises, I mean. Two, one, last round, let's go. Reach and down. Here we go, I know. I know it's tough, but I know you're strong enough to do this. Come on, lift and reach. Woo! This will be the toughest one all day, okay? So get through this and we're cruising. 10 more seconds, come on. Get that knee off the ground, get both of them off the ground and reach. Four, three, two, one, rest. Grab a light dumbbell and place it right in the crack of your knee. One leg at a time, we're going outward circles, up and out, back down. Okay, think about drawing a circle with your leg. Two, one, let's go. Right back to the center. 
Draw a big circle with your knee and come back down. Okay, what we're engaging here, glute medius. That top part of your butt, people say I want a high butt. I want to lift my butt up. You've got to develop that glute medius, which is the top little section of your butt. This is what we're working on here. So you should feel it close to the top of your butt. Remember, you're going up and out and then around. You'll feel it in your other glute as well. Two, one, rest. I want you to stay right here in this leg. Oh, yes, my legs are burning too. This was a quick burn, huh? 15 minutes into the workout and we are on fire. Okay, one more round on the same side. Two, one, let's go. Nice flat back. Make sure when you lift, you're not arching your back either. Keep it flat. Keep your abs drawn in. Keep that heel pulling towards your glute. There we go. 10 more seconds, and then we'll switch sides. There we go. Four, three, two, one, rest. 15 seconds. Switch that dumbbell over to the other leg. I'm gonna grab a quick drink here. You've got five. Two, one, let's go. Lift, bring it around. So this leg is already tired from stabilizing the other side, right? That's okay. It's just warmed up and ready. To make this one tougher, don't stop at the bottom. Just keep circling. Big circles. Let's go, I'm in it with you. 15 more seconds. I'm here, keep working. Circle a little faster if you can. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. You've got one more round on that leg. Woo. And then we'll go to squat pulses, okay? You're doing great, guys. I'm right here with you, I'm pouring sweat too. Woo. Okay, round two, ready, two, one, let's go. Good, up, out, and down, and around. Good, come on, lift it out, just like a fire hydrant. I need you to draw a big circle with that leg, with your knee. There we go, five, four, three, two, one, rest. Whew. Great job. Okay, staying down here on the mat, just because we're already here, I want you to come on up into a high plank, okay? I want you to step up into a squat, one, two, Three, step back, step up, one, two, three. Okay, let's go together, come on. Plank, squat, one, two, three. And if you wanna grab a dumbbell on that squat, you can, so one, two, three. Okay, back and up, never lift your butt. One, two, three. One, two, three. Here we go, keep it going, 10 seconds. Two, one, rest. Okay, stay in that for a second. <laughs> Good job. I know your quads are burning, breathe. Come back into a plank in three, two, one. Let's go, step up, one, two, three. 
And you can also, if you want to step this up, hop back and hop up. Okay, so you want to go here, here. That's okay too. All right, and then three, two, one. All right, if you're ready for that hop back, go for it. Fifteen seconds, and you're done with this exercise. Woo! Anyone else's quads on fire? Good job. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Woo! Okay, let's keep the same dumbbell. We're gonna go pause squats. Okay, so dumbbell is gonna go right at your chest, or if you can, right on the back of your neck, like a good morning. Okay, lower down into a squat with me. Ready? Let's go. At the bottom, hold. Three, two, one. Up, down. Three, two, one. So you've got a three second pause. All right, if this is uncomfortable for you, just bring it right here. That's okay too. And count for three seconds at the bottom of each one of your squats. An honest three seconds too. Here you go, seven seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, Woo. round number two. Hair is everywhere. In the earrings, out. Okay, all good, we're all good. Five seconds, round number two. Grab your dumbbell, let's sit down and pause for three. Ready, let's go. Now keep your knees out and keep your heels down. If you can't do that with the dumbbell on your back, bring it here. Sit down for three, two, one, and stand. Okay, wherever you need to hold it, hold that three second pause in your heels. Good, keep breathing. 15 seconds. Good, five. Let's go one more together. Down three, two, one, rest. Keep this same dumbbell. We're gonna go squat to lunge. Forward lunge. All right, one squat, bring it up, one lunge. Okay, switch legs on each lunge. So we lunge right, lunge left. Two, one, let's go. Squat, one lunge, and then right back to a squat, and then the other leg lunge. There we go. Get those legs burning. On the lunges, I need to make sure that you're dropping your back knee down, and you're not just stepping forward. Drop it down, push back up. Seven seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Woo! Okay, shake the legs out. One more time through. You're doing great. Whew. All right, grab that dumbbell. You got four, three, two, one. Let's do it. Swing right back into the squat, and then step. Step back wide so you go right into that squat. Whew. Almost there. 10 more seconds. Good, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Oh boy, grab some water. <laughs> All right, next one we're going curtsy lunge hops. Move the dumbbells out of the way, move the towel. Okay, I'll give you an extra 15 right here. We've got two exercises left, okay? Curtsy lunge hops is your first one. 
going backwards, hop over, backwards. If you can't hop, just do the lunge and step. Okay, two, one, let's go. 45 seconds right here. Good, now I'm coming back from an injury, so if I'm a little slower than you, don't slow down. Okay, this is your workout. I'm getting stronger, you're getting stronger. Okay, if I'm not as fast as you, don't let that slow you down. You go 100% where you are. If you're stepping it back and you're not jumping, go 100% where you are. Two. Almost there, 10 seconds. Five, four, two, one, rest. Okay, big deep breath. One more round of those. Like I said, I'm working on building my strength back up. If that's slower than you are, go faster. If you need to dial it back a little bit, dial it back and stay safe, okay? It's all about you and your best today. Ready, let's go. Round number two, last round of this one. Here you go, hop it over and down. Over and down, Woo. 15 seconds. <laughs> Legs are on fire. I'm with you, 10, nine, five, four, two, one, rest. Amazing job, grab some water. We've got one exercise left, that's it. All right, three squat pulses and a regular squat. Okay, heavy dumbbell, let's go down together. Okay, we're gonna go three, two, one, stand, regular squat, stand, okay? And then back down for three. go 10 more seconds three two one stand regular squat and back down you've got three two one rest Woo. one more round through that and that's it guys I know your legs are on fire mine are too we're in it together seven seconds and you got one more round of what we just did here we go two one let's go down for three stand up one squat and then back down. Here we go, from the side. Whew, 20 seconds, come on. Keep the knees out, keep the chest up. 10 seconds, what do you got left? Right here, let's go together. Four, three, two, one, rest. Whew. Amazing job, guys. Oh, that was tough. Good job. The tough ones always make you feel extra good at the end, right? You really feel like a beast when you finish those ones where halfway through you're like, uh-oh, this is really hard. Right, you did it, we did it. Let's just breathe for a quick second. I want you to place your feet hip width apart, hands on your thighs, and as you exhale, fold halfway down so your back is nice and flat. Okay, just breathe here. I just want you to fill up your lungs. There you go. And on your next exhale, fold all the way down. There you go. Make sure you stick around for this cool down. I don't want your legs to hurt, hurt, hurt tomorrow and the next day. Okay, it may not hurt tomorrow, but two days after this workout, if you don't stretch, you will regret it. All 
Okay, one vertebrae at a time. I want you to roll up with your head coming up last. There you go, all right. Come back to center, pull your heel to your glute. And these are something I want you to keep doing. Okay, we did a lot, a lot, a lot of quad work today. Tons of quad work, okay? We will switch into a little more glute work in the next week. So if you're a member of that Sydney squad membership, you know on your workout calendar, it's coming soon, okay? Go ahead and switch legs. If you're not a part of that membership yet, I urge you to check it out in the description. 99% of the reason I started that group is to be able to give you nutrition, okay? This is only about, you know, a quarter of the picture in your day. You've got rest, you've got hydration, you've got workouts, and you've got nutrition, okay? So as the clock rolls out to zero, hear me out really quick. If you're not eating the right way, you're not gonna see results. Point blank, you are not gonna see the results that you want in terms of performance, in terms of energy, in terms of losing body fat, the main one that everyone wants, lowering that body fat percentage. If you're not eating the right way, it just will not happen. You cannot out-train a bad diet, okay? Stay tuned for part two of this workout where I dive into a lower ab workout. Again, you're not gonna see the abs if you don't lose that body fat, okay? So check out the Sydney Squad membership in the description below. Let me help you learn how to eat so you can finally see those results. You can step it up. You can pe press on that gas pedal a little bit more getting to your goals, okay? So check that out in the description. Also, great job today, guys. We're not done yet, we've got 10 more minutes of abs. Check the link in the description so you can continue to part two. It's called 10 Minute Lower Abs. And before you head out today, make sure you like this video, give it a thumbs up if you finished it, and also click subscribe so you and I can work out again right now or tomorrow, okay? Great job, guys, I'll see you soon.